Facebook just banned your account. You want to know some tricks, some hacks to not get banned once again? Do you want to understand how to reclaim your ad account once they got banned? Do you want to understand how to build a business manager, an iron business manager who never got banned? So you're in the right place. So maybe you are at the beginning of your business, maybe you just want you just have an, a source, a lead source, a client source, maybe this is Facebook, like I suggest you to start with. And so maybe you are in a weakness position and you want to know, you want to understand how can you protect, protect yourself and your business. So you're in the right place. Watch this video until the very end because at the end, I will give you a, a little bonus of and video. So, <coughs> sorry. Everyone went through Facebook ads in business. Everyone. It's normal. It's common. It will happen over and over again to me, to you, to someone else, to everybody. Even your grandpa, if he'd use it, if you use Facebook for advertisement. You must have, first of all, a mindset, an iron mindset. Because I see on the internet, people got banned and got depressed. They got upset. They lose enthusiasm. And don't really understand what to do. They think it's their fault while it's Facebook fault because it worked like they this. ban your account or your business manager and then they check if there is an issue, there is a, a problem, a violation, whatever, okay, a discrimination. First, they ban you, then they check. Facebook simply work like this. I don't know why, but it is. We must understand how to handle this problem, this kind of problems, because we use Facebook to work, to work and acquire customers, okay? Leads with tourism customers, so. It's very important for us. Be calm, calm down when it happens because it will happen over and over again. And when it happens, just be calm, be relaxed. Don't get upset, don't get mad because it will happen over and over again. We can only prevent those, those facts from happening. Once you got banned, there's don't, just one thing you can do. And I'm going to explain to you later on in this video. So. First advice is to not advertise with your page. With you must use ad profiles, advertisements profile. Okay. Don't use your page because if they ban your account, maybe they think about if this is the case to ban your entire business manager and your page. And this is a big problem if you are based, your marketing is based on your Facebook page. And so understand this. First of all, be calm, iron mindset. Second of all, you must advertise with your own ads profiles, ad accounts. Don't use the page. The third thing is actually that you must have more profile, more ad advertisements account. Because if Facebook ban one of yours, what happens? You got stopped in, in acquire links. Your entire business got stopped by this fact this will happen over and over again you can be stopped every time you got banned okay particularly when you start spending a lot of money you got banned more frequently it becomes a huge problem so you must have more profile and you also must have more pixels okay the pixel must be every every ad account must have a pixel and every pixel should be placed to trigger when someone lands on your landing page so you can understand I mean, your pixel get the same data. Every pixel that you have get the same data, okay? And another tips I can give you is to have one single landing page, okay? So you can understand the traffic who comes from YouTube, from Facebook, from LinkedIn, okay? Just one landing page and put the, the pixel on that page. You cannot be stopped in acquiring leads and customers every time Facebook wake up and decide to ban one of your account. You must have more profiles. 
Another tips I can give you is those profiles must work, must get data thanks to your pixels and must run campaigns, even little ones. Okay, this is the way I, I work with Facebook ads. I have one main ad account through which I make campaigns and then I have two others ad account, emergency ad accounts, where thanks to, to them I only run little campaigns, simple campaign, only lead generation, nothing complicated, only $50 a day, nothing more. It's better to avoid bans if you got different cards on each ad account you have. It's so much better, okay? The more the ads account are different, the better it is. The better it is. So, so there are some credit cards or some, some banks that offer this service and is that you can create virtual credit cards with just one physical credit card. Uh, my banks do it, but this is just an Italian bank, so I don't think it's your case, but if you want a credit card that make this service is Revolut, I'm not affiliate, I'm not making any money. If you want to use it, if you think it's great for your business, it's, it's your case to use it, use it. With this card, you can create more you know, you can create more, how can I say it, uh, virtual credit cards. You set the amount of money you can spend with it, the duration in time that those um, virtual cards is going to have, and then you can use it. They're free. And before buying a Revolut card, maybe ask for your bank, maybe a, a big bank like Bank of America will do it, will have this kind of service. And another tips I'm going to give you about Facebook ads is that if you have, you know, provocative ads, provocative advertisements, you can think about to test them to avoid bans with your one of your emergency accounts, okay? To not get banned on the main account that you're spending $1,000 a day. Now let's talk about the worst idea you can have in Facebook ads. When one of your account got banned, some people got upset, upset, some key people got mad, and a huge error you can make is to think about, well, now I can create a second account and start advertising with this one, with this second account. I create now and I advertise with it. I never used it before and now I spend $1,000 a day. This is one of the worst idea you can have. Just this is wise, it's worth, it's worth the entire duration of this video. So, it's a huge error. If you got banned, if you only have one account because you pr didn't prevent anything, you just one account, you got banned, wait. Calm down, wait to be unban unbanned, and then you can create a second account and start advertise a little bit with it. You, can, you must grow with it. Okay, my target is to take every ad account I have at least $15, $50 a day, at least, okay, to be prepared in case, in case of the, the, main, the main ad account is banned, I got the second to go, I got the third to go, I got the fourth good to go. Don't create a second account when you got banned with the first one. First, we will be, we will be banned as soon as possible. Second, the business manager is in danger because if you continue like this one, if you create the second account, you got banned, the third account, you got banned, the fourth account, you got banned. The problem is that Facebook might be think if this is the case to ban your entire business manager and this is a huge problem. And then if you keep going like this, the problem is that Facebook will put a great attention on you, on your business manager, and the bans become the ban bot become more sensitive, okay, more sensible. Another advice is to respect Facebook times. If Facebook says you with your business manager, you can spend a maximum of all a maximum of two hundred dollars per day. It's $200 per day. Don't try to dock it spending 250 or 300, okay? 
Don't do it. It's simply stupid. You will be banned. Don't do it. It's a mistake. So, respect Facebook time. Another thing you must be aware of is the dangerous and repeated words because Facebook don't like it. Okay? Don't be spammy. Don't repeat too much time. Offer, 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 discount, 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 coupon, coupon, coupon. Okay? Because Facebook don't like it. And be aware of the danger of use dangerous word, you know, like weapon, like bomb. You no, know? this offer is a bomb. I will give you the weapon for your success. You know, this army and military terms, Facebook don't really like it because remember that for the blue social media platform, the best, the most important thing is the community. Facebook don't care much how much you're spending on the platform okay they only care about the community so if you use words like bomb like weapon or too much repeat words the bot the ban bot triggers and ban your account okay stop everything and then we'll check it you know i already explained you how to how facebook bans words wait but first ban you and then they check if there may be an issue so Another thing is very you must put a lot of attention on is the discrimination because all the social media, in particular this one, the blue social media, put a lot of attention on the discrimination. So dangerous lines are you are this, you are that, you are not this, they are this, they're not this, they don't do this, okay? It's dangerous. So prevent this from using. The advice could be that if you're spending $1,000 per day, yes, I have students who do, who do it. As a marketing consultant, I basically have them raising their conversion rate without any, any new expense, any, without raising the marketing budget. If you're interested, click below. There's a, there's a link, you will understand everything we do. And so, if you are spending a lot of money and maybe an advertising campaign got an extreme success in your haters and they start coming and insult you, got upset, got angry, whatever, delete those comments because at that point Facebook says, oh, well, the content um, uh, you're, you're paying for is not really engaging, people don't like it, so they may be think about if this is the case to ban your account so delete the comments if you're spending a lot of money on Facebook and then another thing could be that if you continue to get banned with one with your one of your ad accounts you should consider the idea of delete it okay even if you lose some data delete it because once you get banned with an account one time two times three times ten times the ban but became much more sensitive, okay? And got banned become so much easier. Remember that ad accounts have a reputation and this reputation for, for Facebook counts. If you never got banned with an ad, an, an ad account, you're, you're much more likely to never got banned. If you got banned 10 times ten time in the past 10 weeks, it's so much easier for the bad bond to trigger and ban your account. At this point of the video, do, do you want to restore your account? Ask for a ban. A lot of people are scared to ask for a ban. No, you should do it. Ask for a ban kindly. And this is the, bon the end bonus video will give you the script. You, you write them the script using your data. And in one or two days will be a ban. Guaranteed. I apologize if I inadvertently broke a rule regarding the Facebook community and the use of advertising account. I double checked my work with these accounts and I believe I done nothing wrong. I kindly ask if this, is, if this account can be unbanned. Next time I'll be more cautious in its use. So do this and in one or two day, 24 to 48 hours will be unbanned. Trust me, guaranteed. So, you want to get most out of your advertising campaign on Facebook, you want to 
increase your margin, increase your net profit, and you're spending a lot of money on Facebook advertisement, advertisement might take you too long to go in profit. Start now by clicking the green button down here and get access to the webinar How to Double Your Income in the next four months. The webinar lasts half an hour and in it I will reveal you new information in the American market and will tell you, I will explain you the secrets and the strategy that I personally use to bring in profit the Develop Marketing Consulting, my own company, in the shortest possible time. So don't waste time, get the webinar now and click below.